talking about song of my people, song of his people. Hang on. Yeah, right, Chevrolet. Uh, we won't call it Silverado. I know in the purest, y'all know that Silverado is just a trim packing truck, so it may not, may or may not be a Silverado. So we're just saying it. Uh, it's a fucking shot. Uh, the cab cords already been cut out with a rust. We have the replacement ones right there, so they get to go in. Uh, it is a K1500, 350 TBI, 342 gear G80, obviously four wheel drive on the 16s with swampers. They make a lot of noise. Yeah, you got to cut all that shit out for it to fit, sir. That's on my lap, man. But, uh, it says the old LO5 in here. Runs pretty good. We're going to do a few things this side here. Same thing. It's very, very typical in, uh, what we call OBS, a GMT 400 Chevrolet truck. These things are notorious to go out in. Said you see, I had the 4x4 sticker there, so it's not a Z71, mind you, but nobody would ever know the difference. The only difference between a Z71 and this truck and a regular 4x4 is a skid plate and the shocks that came from the factory, which, being that this thing is a 91, you would hope they're changed. Just letting y'all know. A little OBS information there. See if I get that popped in. I get it. Nope, I didn't get it. Let me try it again. Hang on. You can see that TBI 350 no, glory. AC works, just got needs a charge. But anyway, uh, 
We're gonna put a heater core in it probably this weekend most likely because it needs one they bypassed it and said he didn't work that means it's leaking and luckily these truck heater cores are cheap well they used to be cheap now they're probably a billion dollars but anyway and they're relatively easy to swap out they're like a 25 minute process if you take a 20 minute break in between everything it takes no time at all we cannot stay away from these things there's one and there's two now the story goes let me explain on bed pictured here created for this picture here, not this truck, the picture. So here it comes. Trade for this. So there you go. Somehow it's throwing over the shitty ass Chevrolet. Yes, but at least now you have a four wheel drive with a V8 in it. And gas is $5 a gallon. What? Babe. I never said we were smart, boys and girls. We just trade for what we like. We, we don't use logic and reason in this shit. But we just go for the dumbest man. possible trade humanly possible. Unless we have a K2500 with a 454 and a K1500 with a 350. <laughs> you can see the interior is actually pretty nice. Obviously the headliner's trash. 91 Chevrolet, they're all like that. Uh, it did apparently have at one point it had the visors and caulk to hold them on. Because, you know, that's what people do. Dash in it. Uh, it had the, I'm going to Walmart and get me a radio and I don't need no kit to swap it kit. Huh? It has the, I'm going to Walmart to get me a radio. I don't need no kit to swap a kit in it. God damn right. You don't need no, don't need <laughs> no radio. Cut and jam in, and that, she is meant. If she fits, she ships. But uh, like I said, it's got the old standard st extended cab stuff. Obviously, these doors don't open in this model year. That's just the way it is. And uh, he is going to get a pair of regular uh, 33, 12, 50, 16s on at some point. But, you know, we will be hitting up all the trailer parks near y'all, and you cannot keep the girls off of it, I guarantee you. We wind up just putting a tire exactly like this on it. Now, mine's a little bit narrow because my wheel's narrow, that's why it's tucked in, but that is a 285, 75, 16. I guarantee the door's gonna lock. What else? I guarantee the door's gonna lock because they never do any stuff. Oh, let's find out. Negative on that one, Ghost Rider. Oh, that Somebody's gonna steal your truck from you. They all can't. They never work in these trucks. They all can't be. Hey, but it's got the under hood light. Oh man, that doesn't work. I bet it does. Oh my god, it fucking works. <laughs> Dude, she is cherry. Let me tell you, don't worry about that. That's, that's fine. Uh, we did not put this fan shroud on it, just so everybody knows. This is not us. That, that custom install is not by us. One door lock works, though. So. I thought my Yukon was. One yeah. Door, did Only one door lock, or another one don't. Typical, 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 typical. And like I said, old 350 TBI. Got the Edelbrock air cleaner on, so we know it makes all the power. Now it's up to 191.5 horsepower. Oh, no, this goddamn whore. Yep. She does good. It's more what she never met me. I just don't know what's... I like oh. the ground. I like the ground. Is it even relay? Nope. No, why would you put a relay in there? Oh, there for you. I'm about to fix that. I'm about to... I'm going to redo all that this weekend. It's going to look neat when I'm done. It's that's horse shit. That's nice. <laughs> that's nice AF. Could you at least use black to the tie, so why not just stand like a sword? Oh. That's what they had at Dollar General that day. Oh, my goodness gracious. Yep. Yeah. She's a Gaston County Kajabi. Let's look at the exhaust. The exhaust. It got lobbed off before the muffler. And the crazy thing about these 350 TBI, as long as they got converters in them, they stay quiet. So that's why it's not that terribly loud. As you can see, it is a southern truck, so there's no rust anywhere. It's just these typical, they rust right there. It doesn't matter where you live, they will rust right there. It doesn't matter. You can put this thing in Arizona and that's going to rust. My old race truck off the old, old channel, it rusted in that corner right there. This you thing can see. Rust. Huh? This thing ain't rust. No, I'm saying that's the only thing that rusted. No, I know. I don't know why that one ain't yet. I have no idea. Nice. Must be that special soft the old man had when he owned it. Yeah, it looks pretty good on it, like I said. We can appreciate it. Cool. I like the wheels. Yeah, the wheels are cool for it. So you know the rocker just, it's fine. Just put your hand over that. Yeah, we'll fix that up and bedliner the whole thing, and it, you'll never know what happened. Uh, camo Z71 sticker, light bar. I ain't gonna fight the top of the bottom of it. Yep. Don't worry, we'll leave this here. This is uh, losing that's weight for race. That's character. <laughs> but like I said, it's a good little truck. Got trailer hitch already in it. Ready to go. Ready to go. Now we got two of these things. Eight not in a row. Uh, like I said, the long bed is now gone, so uh, there'll be no building the long bed. The long bed was a 305 truck, and 
trust me nobody in this building around here wants to mess with a 305 it was just a vehicle to get to another vehicle unfortunately i know y'all wanted it nothing i can do about that this one's going to stick around for a little while though okay i can tell you this one here will stick around for a few minutes i'd give it at least a week and a half at least <laughs> then i don't know I got my dream. He's, he's been wanting a four-wheel drive truck for a little bit now. Well, I got my dream. I got my fucking car. Yep. I got my truck. That's all that I wanted. Now I can now say, well, I need a truck. Well, I want a car. Now I got fucking both of them. So I can both. shut the fuck up when I track and just fucking say, I just want to trade, all right? Yep, exactly. Truth to find come out. Like I said, I do like it. I approve the trade. I'm not a big S10 guy. See, so. the mayor that trailer, I get bored with things. I can just yeah. go from one to the other. Get bored one, go to the other. Get bored one, go to the other. But like I said, I... I do have a soft spot for four-wheel drive ones. I do like lower two-wheel drive trucks when we wrong, but long bed trucks, I mean, they're an acquired taste. And, uh, yeah, it's hard I, It's hard for me to get in, in love with a long bed truck. They're, they're hard for me. I can, I'll can i bring them here, and I'll say I'm going to do stuff with them. Then I'm like, two days later, like, this thing's got to go. Long bed sucks. <laughs> it's just... It's just Plus it's on a crew cab or a finna cab. Yeah. yeah. Hey, this is a long bed truck here, but, you, you know... It is. It, it fits the proportionality of this thing. It's just huge. Sad thing is compared to uh, NBS 2500, this thing's tiny. <laughs> it's actually a foot shorter than NBS 2500. We measured it one time. Points out, yeah, I realized my uh, marker light's off. I had the replacements in there. I did the middle, the one on this side, and I was too lazy to do the rest of them. Now I'm going to have to do them all because that broke. That's gone. That one over there is broke. So, But I've got, I did those two when I first got it, and I never did these out ones. So I'll get it done. I got them in the house. I will do that tomorrow when it's not a bazillion degrees out here and you bake yourself raw on that hood. I tried getting it the other day on the hood of it and I literally could hear my legs sizzling like a thing of strip of bacon. It's a lot of fun. I was hungry too, so I kind of left it up there for a minute because it smelled probably pretty good. Then it didn't smell Dang, good. I can use that thing in the trailer park and I could bang all my sisters. But anywho, oh, yeah. we're not going to the trailer park banging our sister. We don't go that far. We just go around the street. But anyway, kidding, 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 kidding. Uh, that's all we got for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Like I said, 91 four-wheel drive, 350 truck. And now we have a 98 454 four-wheel drive truck. Lots of bad decisions in our life. We're used to that. We base our life totally on uh, gut instinct and horrible decision-making skills. So oh, yeah. hope you enjoy it and stick around and have fun because Lord knows we're going to make another bad decision for this weekend is completely over. Trust me. I can guarantee that to you. So see you later. Bye. You hit that like and subscribe down below. That'd be really cool as hell too. I mean, you know, I'm like on my 15th channel here. I need some help. I'm going to send this help a brother out. Could you? Thank you.